Hard work has paid off for strength and conditioning coach Jason Blackburn here at Minot State University. Blackburn has gone from training athletes out of his mobile trailer to training the big-timer athletes at a Division II level. The whole thing started as a mobile sports acceleration unit. Um, the idea was actually hatched in 1999. Um, so we, we, we were out, went around to like eight high schools and sports specifically trained um, football players for eight weeks prior to their season. So we had two crews. Uh, my five-year plan was to have a site, do this you know, full-time professionally. Due to the Division II transition, MSU's athletic director Rick Hedberg has been planning for the past two years on making Blackburn official. Hedberg says about 70 percent of Division II universities have hired a strength and conditioning coach for their programs. You know, it's pretty obvious that um, the, the, the work that they do, the strength, the strength and conditioning area is, is critical for um, us to compete within you know, the Northern Sun and within Division II across the country. Let's see what Blackburn's main goal is for MSU athletes. Right here at Minot State, so making the move from, you know, to Division II is a big deal. So I wanted to be in on the ground floor of that, affect that change on, on a big level, on a massive level, and that's what we're trying to do with all the athletes we're working with, all the teams, is can I, can I find out for myself all the protocols, all the science behind what we do, can we really, you know, turn the tide with you guys going to Division II right now, and that's really what we want to do. Many are very excited to see the outcome next year as MSU officially becomes a Division II program. I'm Francesca DeAngelis, reporting for KMSU Channel 19 News.